All right, guys. I'm back from eating my pizza and getting it and whatever. So, um, what I was doing last time was I was painting this, and um, now I got to paint over here and on the top right here. Pretty good. Uh, what's it called? Pretty good in timing. I'll worry about that later. I'm just gonna... mm. I think what I'm gonna do is backwards. Just then I can see what I'm doing. Then I'll show you when I'm done. I had pizza, and then uh, my dad went to McDonald's, and he was like, you want it? So I was like, yeah, just get me something for later, and then uh, got me a cheeseburger for later, probably for like uh, for dinner or something. Just trying to finish this up before uh, I can do anything else. This is probably, this is my second project, which I totally forgot to uh, show you guys. Like I said, uh, I would come back and show you guys the uh, first project I did. Nerf. Um, I'll show you that right now. Um, let me go get it. So my first project was, I just painted it all black. I have some coloring right here. Just kept the orange. Um, in, in my perspective, or like what I did was, there's like some streaks of blue, uh, but when it's like dim in a room, you can't really see it, it's just as dark. When, it, when, when it's light out, you can see like shades of blue or just streaks of blue on the gun so I just kept like the stuff orange orange and everything else good the one thing I was really proud of is the nerf thing where it says nerf you can't really see it but it says nerf and it's like really smooth and it's really nice well made with the paint and uh and then I tried making a design for the trigger some orange on there then the light still works as you can see I just pointed it at you guys <laughs> yeah, light still works. I put new batteries in there. Um, it shoots perfectly fine. Sometimes it malfunctions like this. It'll, it'll be like this a lot, but then uh, it'll be really hard to uh, cock it back. See? It's really hard to cock back, but I will still use it as a weapon. But yeah, that was, um, that was what I had. First, uh, weapon. More paint soon. But yeah, that was my uh, my first ever painting of a Nerf gun. It was really fun too. I was on the phone with um my good friend Austin, and he was playing Red Dead Redemption, and I was just painting. So, um, today's Friday. Which means I have off tomorrow, Sunday, and then Monday. And I got to go Tuesday to school. Which will be just fine. Uh, let's see right here. Alright, I can't get anything around here, so I'm gonna put this. Get the tape. So I'm gonna need tape this big, right? About maybe an inch, just so 
I don't get any paint or anything over here. Just put it on. Just so no paint gets on it. That's the only thing I don't want. Because uh, this guy right here, I put paint inside. Kind of, well not inside, but I put paint on the trigger. And um, it's kind of hard to have my finger on it. Try not to do that with this, because this is the trigger I don't want anything happening or going inside it and making it like really bad to pull. Or either this, because this is what cocks back and you can put in the clip and then cock it back and do whatever. But yeah, this weapon was really hard to try and get out. I'm surprised that this still works. And uh, this still works. But um, other than that, this can be like a prop or something. But for now, that just looks cool as it is. Let me get back to my painting. Let's see. So yeah. Just trying to get everything correct. Over here. Just trying to make the weapons look cooler. Nothing that bad. Shoot. I don't know how I'm going to take off the tape, but, um, I need more tape for this right here, a little weapon that, uh, you take out the clip. I need more tape right there. Sometimes just tape helps with, like, minor things. Shoot, I just got paint all over me. But, um, just a little paint helps. I had to use this. I don't know how I'm gonna get around here, but um, for now, I'm just keep it like that and then do everything else. But yeah, everything else will be different. And then I'll show you. I'll show you guys once. Uh, once it's done uh, with the front side. When, once it's done drying and everything, and I'll show you guys the front side because I think it'll be really cool to look at. Was, uh, it looks really nice right now. And I'm surprised that um, it looks just nice. I think I'm gonna keep the gray, right? I think I'm gonna keep the gray, the, the stock or whatever. I'm gonna keep the stock gray, just so it has a gun feeling to it. I'm gonna need a pizza. Uh, excuse me, oof. Jesus, eating that pizza really, really gave me the hiccups. It's giving me burps. Excuse me for that, though. It's a really long day, to be honest. Doing this and then doing something last night. I'm doing a lot of this from last night. I'm doing the, uh, The other weapon, the revolver. I don't know what it's called, but whatever it is, it's a pretty good weapon. Cause like, if I didn't want to use my like ARs or anything, or any gun that I had, I would always use that. Or I would pick a different revolver on my little section, and that would be good. But yeah, that was like basically my main weapon to use. Is you know, you have to use a magazine for all of them, and you just need to use three bullets, or you get two bullets for whatever you need, and then boom, you're finished. And you don't have to worry about ah, many things. I'm gonna get 
back down here. I'm gonna sit on my butt for a second. Everything looking good. Um, is this dry? I don't know if this is dry. Probably not. Neither is this dry. I'm just gonna get more of this over here. Then, uh, what I'm gonna do after this, I'm gonna take one of the paper towels and go in between here or maybe what I can do is uh, I need more paint that's for sure get more paint on here so basically it's not smudged oh man should I get a haircut me for me I think I might to be honest I might grow it out a little more try and go back to the uh early ages of my life. Go back to that bowl cut. Nah, I'm not gonna the bowl cut, but just go back into the old times where I kinda had a bowl cut, but it was like in between. Okay. Now, the problem is I look at these streaks and there's like a little bit and that's it. But then I look after, and it's like a big ass mess. Um, I'm gonna go in between here because I'm not gonna change the stock. You just see in the back here. Looking good. Looking good so far. I should have went in between and just went through and just gotten it, but um, this is going to be really important. Oh, shoot. This is going to be really important. Oh my freaking god, dude. It's actually on me. This phone is slipping. But uh, one thing is, fucking phone, man. One thing is, is uh, I'm glad that I put tape right here. I'm going to cock it back and then this and this I put tape over should have put tape over this just so if someone actually needs to put it back like if uh, like one of my cousins comes over and they want to play with this weapon then they can put it back so it's not that big on them but I'm going to keep it like this because my weapon I can do whatever I want with my weapons I should say guns because they're not really well they're weapons but they're Guns that shoot fire bullets, to be honest. Now I'm going to go on and just go in between. I'm also going to try and go in between here. Good. All right. Just a little more paint over inside. Jesus, my my throat. Now, um, I think, guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait until it's dry. I'm gonna watch some more YouTube or whatever I have to do. See if there's any other weapons I could probably do during these uh, these four days I have left. Got a bunch of guns I can paint, but um, I just this. Just do this one. Go on without it. See if there's anything cool that turns out, and then uh, I'll come back to you guys. I'll be back boys, I'll be back.